Hello there. Maybe you've just started online, maybe you've just started a blog or you've got a website or whatever, and you hear these people keep telling you, you've got to start capturing leads. I mean, what's all this fuss about capturing leads, right? Today, in today's Helpful Hint, I want to tell you exactly why you should be doing that, right? My name is Peter Beckenham from peterbeckenham.com. And today, I want to talk to you about why it's so important for you to start capturing these leads. Now, what I mean by that is you're actually capturing the email addresses of people who visit your site, whether it's a blog or whether it's a website or whatever. Now, they're not just going to give you their email address, right? You've got to come up with something pretty special to offer them as a bribe, so to speak, right? For them to share their contact details with you. And by the way, there's a whole range of options here. Many people say, just ask for their email, okay? And you'll get a lot more sub uh, people subscribing. Well, that's true. That is true. However, I'm not sure what the quality is going to be. What I'm suggesting you do is, sure, maybe just ask for their email, but have it as a double opt-in. In other words, they've got to go and confirm, click a link in the email that they give you, right, before they get your free gift. It's an extra step. It means you're going to reduce the number of subscribers you're going to achieve. I understand that. But the quality of your subscribers, I think, will be a lot better. In my experience, it's been anyway, right? So... You've got yourself a free gift, okay? Now, if you need help in how to create a free gift, let me know. Contact me, okay? Support at peterbeckenham.net. That's my email address, or you can Skype me. Peter.beckenham, the only one in Thailand, okay? But contact me if you need help in how you can create your own free gift. But once you've got your free gift, and once you've got your subscriber, right? Let me tell you, here's a bit of a shock for you. They really don't give a hoot about you. They're not the slightest bit interested in you at all. The only reason they join you is because of your free gift, right? That's all they're interested in. What you've got to do is build a relationship with them. You've got to show them that you can give them lots and lots of value, that you are someone that's worthwhile staying on a list with, okay? Because if you can do that, you can get them to know you, get them to like you, and hopefully trust you over a period of time. And when you've got that in that particular situation, guess what? Your email list will be the most valuable asset you've got in your business. To get all the products you've got, whatever it may be, your email list will be the number one thing in your business. So it's worth it to start as soon as you can, because it is the best asset you're going to have. And secondly, you've got to make sure you're continually adding value to that. Now again, like the free gift, if you're not sure what value you should be giving them, let me tell you, it's got to be relevant to them. Whatever your niche may be, make sure the value you give to them is relevant to them. Otherwise, what's the point, right? There's no point in trying to sell a dog owner something about cat food, right? So that's my helpful hint for today. And again, if you need some help, contact me, okay? And by the way, if you enjoyed this hint, then come and join with me anyway, okay? You'll find a link somewhere near this video. Come and join with me. Join my list. I'm delighted to work with people on my list. I enjoy them. I like to see them achieve success. And by the way, if you join today, just for joining today, you'll get access to 25 hot ways to drive targeted traffic to any website you want. It's a one hour free training video I've done and it's available to you right now. Okay, so look for the link. Come and join with me, Peter Beckham, The Village Marketer. I look forward to sharing it with you, looking forward to getting to know you and hey, you never know, we may become business partners one day. Okay, all the best and bye for now.